I mean, being out for so long, I mean, last year, like getting injured at the time, I was just devastated because I know like we were making a run for the playoffs. So it was really devastating, but I was really excited to get back out there, like having the support of the staff, like my teammates, everyone, like it just felt awesome. I felt really supported and obviously wanted a better result, but we're going to use these next couple of games to get better and improve. much did you learn from that first injury going into the second that you kind of felt a little bit better about going through the process and coming back on the other side? I mean, definitely tearing my ACL was the worst thing ever and knowing my ankle was only a couple of months. So that was like easier, like easing the pain, but um, obviously giving myself grace and time to come back properly and really using this time to reflect on how I can get better and how I can... Um, just help my teammates too, like being able to watch their games during preseason and kind of seeing like, okay, what do they need? Like, what do I see so I can give them feedback? So that was really nice, just um, being able to support my teammates and having them support me as well. Like every day I was out there um, doing my workouts, um, they were always cheering me on. So it was really nice. So I learned to give myself a lot of grace and to support my teammates in any way I can. I mean, they were very vocal about how they really wanted me to just, like, come back 100% and be ready not to rush anything. Um, so it really, like, gave me peace of mind to just, like, okay, like, they're confident in me. Like, I'm confident in myself and my abilities and them working with me, like, on the ball and um, just day in and day out, just being there for me was really, really nice. I mean, I was definitely nervous. Um, first game back is always just like a bundle of nerves, but I was very confident in my ability and I just wanted to be able to play the best version of myself. Um, obviously, like coming back from like a couple months out, um, I wasn't going to be 100%, but just getting that exposure and just getting that first game down just ticked the box. So, yeah, excited for the next games. Speaking of the next games, you're playing North Carolina. I mean, I think we're approaching it with uh, just a hungry mindset. We need to get these three points. We need to win, especially at home. So I think we're really hungry for that result. When you look at North Carolina, um, especially the, the way things kind of have changed, how much are you kind of looking back at last year's games, the games you played against them, and uh, taking stock into that versus you know, the games that they played this year? I mean, they're definitely a different team. I think um, obviously they have really good players, but I feel like we can match up. And definitely if we stick to our principles, our game plan, we can really show out for our home crowd. Now, this being the Challenge Cup, obviously it's not in the league, but how important is it to kind of get uh, momentum going uh, as you head into this kind of Challenge Cup run now? Uh, yeah. Take into the season. Yeah, I think any game in this league is going to be hard. It's always important. and you know, these games are always an opportunity for us to get better and improve on the things that we've been lacking. So I think Challenge Cup is also like a really good opportunity for us to work on the things and um, just improve overall.